front. And it's going to be good down to one and two. Lights are out. Let's let yeah, they're going to wreck. They're going to wreck Green lap one, turn one. We're underway at Kentucky. Those are the guys up front, like Joe Graff. This is my second pull off of the inversion. These guys are definitely smart on what they were trying to do with that inversion. And that's what, and how they have traction, track position. Still dirty. You saw that. Oh. Nine of no regrets will get loose down there. I think it's just a product of this. Place. Oh, yep, there it is. Oh, man. Already in the no, wall. Kyle That's Weatherman. Seven to Kyle Weatherman had a career best last year. Finished eight, started in the top ten. Damn. And just like yesterday evening, problems oh. on the opening lap. Man, it's still so green. Long, three and four. Oh. Yeah, we're yet to How see there a no caution? caution. A lot of debris. What the hell? Where the hell is the caution? Jumping to the race lead. Did, my, did he check out of the gas Jesus. because they thought the yellow was going to come out? That's a great point, Curry. Very well could have been. I cannot believe there was no yellow there. I let it race. What the For hell? For whatever reason, this traction compound and the racetrack is very, very slick on the NASCAR first. NASCAR just Man, that's such a disappointing start. Won't it? Mike what Harmon the... for him and his team. So Mike Harmon's been around forever in the series. Last night, the first time they had a top ten finish in. in I don't understand that at early. all. And here is how Jeremy Clements got the top spot away from Myatt Snyder coming off of turn four. Uh, Snyder's got loose. Got loose right there. there. Yep. Again, I just think it's a product of that traction compound. It takes heat. You gotta burn the heat into that thing before you get the grip of the. Whoa, car. no Sieg! Well, there's the damn caution. Ah! Uh, oh! Damn it! You don't see that mistake. That wouldn't have happened if Janakar just threw the damn caution. I don't know what the uh, call weatherman. I don't know what they're thinking there. They're so inconsistent. Such a good start. The hell? some problems when we returned from Jeez. that long break but they were back in the top 10 last night and consistently couldn't make the save they're cautions i swear to god we Jeez. talked about this winding your group it Jeez. just doesn't look Christ. like it's down and kurt and i talked about this and made note of this it looks like they did a little bit more work down at three and four than they did one and two again just looked like he was down there in slick conditions got loose on lost two oh, great guys man, <laughs> Kentucky's for crashes for Kyle Weatherman on lap the one Ryan Sieg damn should have collected my Snyder I don't know how you can collect anybody else slip, either slip just a little I think Alfredo could get everybody loose, loose. there's the tire especially when you're on the inside of Snyder on the fast side of the track down in one and two it's way faster than it is made their green flag pit stop Riley Herbst penalty oof terrible Herbst when you're making a green flag pit stop, it's a Just fixing to say, hats off to these guys. They've done a great job. A lot to ask out of these guys, not having that experience coming on. Terrible Herbst. These conditions, and then we kind of Jones, man. Really fast. Oh my the God. Is turn one and two. Man, there is no grip in the low group. Brandon now. Jones. The kid's done a great job all night, running third, and then throws it away. With, well, with Henry, Henry. <clears throat> that huge lead, he didn't want to Guard see off that. the ground. Well, no, it doesn't. <laughs> I mean, here we are side drafting, and you know. Of course, I wasn't recording. Because I was going to actually trying to edit the video. One. Jones wants or something to stay else. In the gas. He's got all that air pushing down on his nose, and now, boom. Wait, wait. Lucky you didn't collect oh, Emmer. Bam! Man, Brandon Jones. That sucks. Very frustrating to be able to try to pack down. Good job right there. Aper got a good jump. He's, he's got to be careful. He just learned what going into the inside of turn one can do. He's going to do it. There you go, Danny. Whoa! No! He went for it. I'm going to pay the price now. We're not going to walk the second. He moved up too quick, you know? Uh oh, uh oh. No, there they go! Burns in the wall. Gregson's in the wall. So does Gregson. Those boys are going to pay a huge price. Uh, go time. Money's on the line. If you're out of chances, got to go for it. And Justin Allgaier's back up inside the top ten after all of that. Then Mustang drum, boys. And what have we seen <coughs> continuously? It's that inside groove is so tre treacherous. Guys cannot get the grip that they need down there, and you're just washing up into the car on the outside. Allgaier back in the top ten, seventh. Huge, huge change of events for him and his race team. <clears throat> yeah, I love this this angle right here. Driving down into turn three with Gragson on the inside. He's trying to keep into the PJ1 spray, but that car on his outside took away all of his side force, and he's just going to get moved up and then burns there. Yeah, that's pretty unfortunate. He drove it off in there. It's a pretty aggressive move. 
fortunately took the position from both of those guys and really did. Bottom line, just didn't work out. Out of time, desperation, that's gotta go for it. That's what you're gonna be doing. Bert was in that wrong spot. It's tough for him to back out, you know? Yeah, I don't know that he was in the there. wrong spot. He was in the catbird spot, it just didn't work out. <clears throat> <laughs> Could have told you that was going to be coming over the radio. Yeah, more advice than an A. Exactly right. right. Give it that clean air. And both of them running consistent Five times enough. here at the end. Oh, oh, there's a caution to that. Let's see. All right, we'll take finish. This is going to get good. Uh, Their teammates. Off in there, but they have gotten together before. They're not afraid to get together. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, slipped up. Went loose. Kept her off the yep. fence, and Alfredo's going to catch him on that one. <clears throat> so frustrating right there. Burton back in 12. How about this? The last driver to win on consecutive nights in the same series. The King, Richard Petty in 1971. Hey, be careful. Every time we talk good about somebody and they have trouble, let's just <laughs> let's make sure that he gets a hair and he can beat Petty's from 1971 record. We should have waited for the white flag before we had that ah, thing up, huh? Man, it makes you feel bad. Let's go to this guy. Oh, he got caught speeding on pit road. Had a wheel come loose. Let's go to this guy. This guy's doing good. Why oh, he just cracked? It's like we're jinxing him. <laughs> Got those two Fords out front, and then we've got Haley and Chastain. Got a couple Chevys running third, fourth. That's pretty good comeback for those guys. They were swatting flies, it looked like, early on. And just, again, the first one. Back. And then the Chastain just did the wave around, right? He did. And so he still got the free pass. Yeah, just push car one lap down. Doing it, man. He's a guy that can move like that. that. Hard-nosed racer. So, yeah, give me the ball. I want to run with it. This is just like last night. The Colic cars, maybe not a part of it all night long, but when we got down to the end, they made found their way to the front. Yep. Found a way. It's what you have to do. Here comes Cedric off the turn four. He'll see the white flag this time around. Textbook kind of night. He executed perfectly. One entry on a green flag run. One lap. And then with this lead laps, get the stage win. And I need to try to do a Credit One plug right now. It's one to go. Brought to you by Credit One. Thank you for bringing this out. <laughs> it's all in the family over That's there, right. right? They're on our cards at Ganassi. Thank you, guys. Good job, Cindy. Do it, Cindy. Huh? You're stealing my job. Hey, now Here we I go. got to brag a little bit. How about it was one of my three things right here talking about can Cindric close the deal can he sweep the weekend and he did it just that pretty nice stuff on Ford Mustang and Victor Lane big weekend for that guy in Kentucky alright Austin Cindric he started the damn hammer got dumped <laughs> Austin Cindric goes back to back and sweeps Kentucky excellent job excellent job Thank you. Let's do this again. Yes, sir. Gonna have to wait a week this time. It won't be tomorrow. Yeah, yeah I think Annette dumped Emmerich on the end there. <laughs> Haley ends up third. That's exactly what happened. Eh, nah. no. Looks like they ain't got moved a little bit. I mean, yeah. Man, I those are oh, junior motorsports guys. Then he hung up, tried to get down side draft, and Annette got loose, put him in the wall. Hammer ended up ninth. There's gonna be some pissed off drivers. Foster on in there. Man, cost him a couple <laughs> spots right there. That junior motorsports competition meeting. <laughs> be pretty interesting this week. Awkward. Check Oh, to the second gear scratch. For third gear, yeah, I would say, man, you yeah. want those uh, <laughs> keys over the radio? Burn it down. Burn that baby down. Yeah, we don't need to suck it. Yeah, great burnout. Great win. Great two win. Man, they made the call too. Four the car's backing up. Gave, Watch gave the, up, the, gave up car. the track position and then boom. How about this? He had never won last year. He goes back to back on the road courses. Watkins Glen in mid-Ohio. And he comes into this weekend winless in 2020. And again, two in a row. 
winning last night and tonight. First two victories on an oval in the Xfinity Series. Power of momentum, you can't outrun it. Momentum, confidence, right there, that's what they have. And we said it earlier, stage winner has never won at Kentucky. You can erase that from the staff book. Fix that problem. Yeah. He's full of enthusiasm, always is. I like these interviews, he does a good job. He and Brian Wilson won for the first time. Cut out three in a row. Chief combo he didn't screw in up the Indy. series <laughs> right here at Kentucky. It happened a few years ago, and boy, they're feeling the love in the bluegrass once again, Jamie. Austin Cedric, the tallest driver in the field, and tonight he dominated. Austin, most the hell's car in the car. What the? Fix the. In one Jesus single Christ. race. But you know what was different tonight, Austin? You got to burn it down. How much fun was it to actually make it official? Well, I hope I laid enough rubber down to make up for Watkins Glen last year. That was pathetic. So, um, <laughs> yeah, no, I'm just so excited. Uh, this is this is all credit to my team, you know. Well, what we did tonight was really impressive because we ran one set <clears> last night and won the race. And we came with another setup and won the race again. Um, and, and that's that happens at the shop. That happens with with the guys in the box. So. All credit to them. I'm the lucky one that gets to drive this half on Ford Mustang. Thank you to my line and ours. This guy's tire. Everyone who puts this puts this together. Odyssey battery. Um, thank you to everyone. Four performance. One, two between me and Chase. You know, I got I got a text from Mark Rushbrook, head guy from Ford, telling me we need to have a one, two with me and Chase. So there you go, Mark. We'll do it again. That was a lot of fun. Austin, what was it like for you? 17 to go. Brian goes in the crew chief says, oh, we're not coming in. We are staying out. Then the last minute call, you wanted your car to be a little bit better. What is that moment like hoping that other people fall you down? Uh, I trust my man. You know, it's 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 a man. Uh, it's, it's a team sport, and that's why. Obviously, he made the right call, and uh, that's why you sit on the box and I'm uh, <coughs> in the car. Congratulations. Thank you, Jamie. Austin Sindrick makes it two in a row on an oval here at Kentucky. Jamie with the rare stats, tallest driver in the field, and his dad, president of Team Penske, Tim Sendrick. Uh, Who's these guys? Did play college basketball. Gregson's don't got a mask on. And look, this is moments ago. Noah Gregson with Harrison Burton. Still, still yeah, man. boosted. Now, now, crew members do arrive. Harrison not backing down. Yo, whoa. Oh! They're oh, they're, they're swinging. Oh! Holy crap! Here's another angle. Damn! Hey, man, you hit me. No, man, you hit me. Passion. No, man. Oh, 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 man. Friday Night Lights. Oh. Whoa! Woo! Now, I thought in this era of social distancing and masks and all that... Yes, sir! Damn! ...this kind of post-race activity, but you can see... Even though it's dark and it's off in the distance, this thing lingered for a little bit. Oh, this yeah, little man. conversation back there in the lights, huh? <laughs> that is the passion. This is going to continue. I hope we got a different view of this. I wonder where Kim is freaking out. I, I, I would know, you know? I, I would know, yeah. And here's Annette and Hammer. What the? Oh, that's the Junior Motorsports situation, huh? What the? This is tense. These guys have been here all weekend long. What the hell is going on? We got... Annette Hammer. Well, I don't know where they are. Good hard side by side racing. I knew there was gonna be a fight. Hey, let's go to break real quick. There's Annette. Oh. And once again, the flag plant from Austin Center. Damn. Oh my God. Burton the God. How about Harrison? He beat the shit out of him. Well, he tried. I don't know. We didn't have a really good view of it. Well, we did, but. <laughs> oh, here. Here's another one. I don't even know. <laughs> there was a net. A net was there. I don't know where Hemrick ended up. Ooh, rivalry. There you Took a side condition, and then uh, once we finally got to where I thought we could have been, uh, to get taken out like that was frustrating. So, um, you know, I was just frustrated. And, I want to see uh, Noah talk. Yeah. Just sorry for our race team that happened. Well said. Thanks, Harrison. All right, we're going to walk over here and catch up with Noah Gregson, who is over here with his team. Hey, Noah. We just saw the replay, you and Harrison. 
We heard his take. What's your take on what happened between the two of you? Um, I, uh, I was battling uh, with our switch Camaro all race and spent on pit road there early and uh, <clears throat> got us in a hole and was just back in traffic. This, uh, this track is so much about just track position and three starts and I don't know. Um, a fortunate day for our switch team at Junior Motorsports. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll go on and fix this and move for he said that this started back in Charlotte, actually. Did you see that coming between the two of you? Uh, not really. No. I mean, I'm... It's like, oh shit, get the basketball box with mask back on. <laughs> our teammates were beating Megan for the finishes at the end and whatnot. So, um, I don't really have a comment. I haven't really seen everything that happened. But, uh, just thankful for this opportunity. Everybody at Team Motorsports is working really hard and, uh, we're gonna go rebound to Texas. All right, thanks, Noah. Mass is falling down. Noah's 21. Burton's 19. These guys are gonna be uh, around a while. This and uh, to see them go at it like this, <laughs> not not just throughout their career, but throughout this season. And a couple of guys that have won races, they're gonna be a part of the championship <laughs> equation this season. Yes, they Shit. are. But more impressed with Jamie's ability to get an interview. <laughs> With not one of them, but both of them in that squabble. Yeah. Good job, Jamie. That was awesome. Awesome finish. A lot happened right there. Curves in the end of this Xfinity race. Just goes to show you, you never know what's going to happen at the end of these things. I mean, Kentucky Speedway is one of those tough, tough tracks to do restarts on. And with the preferred groove being where the spray is and the traction going down, everybody's fighting for that same spot. Two guys going.